TV. Welcome to video two and level two. Congratulations if you've completed level one. If you haven't, go back. I said don't skip the levels, do level one. What we're going to do now is we're going to do a, the same sort of game, but slightly different. So this time, again, we're going to put the walls in. You can do this one of two ways. You can use the paper, like we said before, or masking tape if you've got it. Again, you've got your mini numbers, which are here. We're going across 11 to 6. And then on the corners of the 13 and the 14, and the corners of the 8 and the 10, so that gives us roughly about two and a half numbers with the little bits that we lose in between. This is important. Now, it's important to stay straight, which is what we worked on first, but it's important not to forget our horizontal training. Quite often, we might be left on tops. A lot of finishers leave us on tops, so we need to start being able to get that line right. Same across the bottom with the threes, and also with some of the trebles that we go for. Sometimes we're going to switch over to the 18s, the 16s. They're on quite a horizontal line, so we need to get that horizontal training going. Same game as before. 15 darts in the section. If you burst the tape or break the walls, start again. I'll give you a quick demo. Okay, just all you need to do is just get them inside that section. You can use the ball as a bit of a focal point. That's three. Remember, I need to try and get myself to 15 points in a row. So I'm throwing away. If I burst the tape, I'm back down to zero. And there's one point again. So 15 hits in a row without bursting the walls. Edgar TV. Congratulations if you was able to complete level 2. Make sure you move on to level 3. 10 levels in total for you to have a go at right here on Edgar TV. And don't forget to hit subscribe where we play games like this some of the time.